Hello everybody, Ragtag Sagvi here. Welcome to the next episode. In the last episode, we did some um activities around the monastery, and now I think it's finally time we go and check out out uh, uh, Yuritsa's room. So let's head there. Professor Yuritsa, are you there? He does not seem to be here. Hmm? On the ground. Professor Manuela. Is she injured? She's unconscious. Someone clearly attacked her. Look at her hand. It looks as though she is pointing at something. There. There's an opening behind that shelf. Perhaps a secret passageway. What is the meaning of... Wait, is that Manuela? What happened here? We know as much as you do. She needs to be taken to the infirmary. Yes, of course. And quickly, give me a hand, child. Understood. I'll support her head. Professor, I'll be back shortly. Please be careful. Does this mean Professor Yuritsa did it? Could he also have kidnapped Flane? We should start by investigating this passageway. Do you agree, Professor? Let's investigate. Agreed. The culprit could be hiding inside. That settles it. We'll take the offensive. Here we come, you monsters! Shall we, Professor? I never would have imagined. Hmm? I see someone. They're unconscious. Is it Flame? Yes. And there is someone else, too. It appears to be another student. Someone's coming. I recognize that Scython mask. It's that jerk we fought at the Holy Mausoleum. That sword. You must be. One of us will die. The other will live. I will enjoy this dance of damnation. You just gotta wait for loading. All right. So let's take a look at the map. So you are gonna be fighting the Dark Knight. The Dark Knight. <laughs> What is this, Batman? <laughs> no, the Death Knight, this is a force fight. You do have to fight him. Um, you are always guaranteed to get a Dark Seal here. But yeah, you have to fight him. Um, because it's a force fight, he is around a level that you can somewhat take on. Okay, we have a chest this way. So I want to send somebody this way to go get that chest. Although it will mean that they will mostly be staying out of the fight. Oh, that's also another thing. Um, if we look at our units. Edo uh, Guard is not with us. She is considered unavailable. This is one of the few missions she is not available in. So keep that in mind. Uh, 
Uh, trying to think. Yeah, there's a chest here. I'm trying to see if there's any other chest on the map. That I have to worry about. I don't see any additional chests I need to worry about. Okay. Yeah, you have lockpick, so I could send you, and you have a lot of movement, so you could potentially get the chest and then come back fairly quickly. Da 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 da. Yeah, I don't think I'll bring any of the students, at least not them as... Because, yeah, I've just recruited them, so they would struggle a little bit. Ah, uh, I might actually just send Anne after the chest, because... Yeah, I might actually do that. I might keep happy there. Now let's switch out Bernadetta for a little bit. And bring Samir. No, I don't think I'll bring her. Actually, you have lockpick, don't you? Yeah, you do. Alright, out of the new students I've recruited, who has conversations? You can have her. Give Leone to you. for adjacent. I want them to also gain support points. And not I could also just give them to me. Ooh. Yeah, I know for a fact you have support with Ferdinand, so I'll give you that. Alright, how am I... Ooh, gonna need a new steel sword. See, you're doing alright on lances. You don't need a new axe. I will sell that gold, that though. Doing okay with swords. You don't really. Uh, I might buy you an extra bow. Is that the one? Thanks a bunch. Is that the one? Thanks a bunch. And I'll buy you an extra bow just in case. Is that the one? 
Thanks a bunch. To replace Italians. Come back we should be good to go. So we so we have to try and beat this map in twenty five turns. Our objective is to recover flame. Let us hope we are not too late. Hmm. Something odd about the floor over there. What will happen if we step on it? I'll give it my all. Let's find out. Ooh, critical hit! Right off the back, you're dead. The fight continues. All right, let's start making our way through. Yeah, because I believe this way only leads to this chest. I think. Stay focused. As you wish. I'll attack this guy. Let the lesson begin. Love that quote, let the lesson begin. <laughs> I am Ferdinand von Eyer. Ferdinand, ride to battle. Only a fool challenges me. Got a door key. I will get the victory. Put me in there. Ugh, battle. Uh, yeah. That's my cue. I owe you one. To work. <laughs> Use some dark magic. How humiliating. Shut. <laughs> you hear attack this archer, please. <laughs> they are so dead. Way over here. Just want you to smack this guy with fire. Oh, that was a woman. Never mind. I'm dangerous. What was this item? Rusted bow. Activate the sofa shield. I thank you. Found a mini bow. Thank you. 
be right over here and stab this guy. Contraptions in the floor. Stay alert. Luck is always on my side. The evade floors. Terrain that raises evade. So whatever is on it is more likely to dodge things. Wow, I'm getting a lot of critical hits this battle. Another one down. I call this episode like critical rescue or something like that, because Jesus, we're getting a lot of crits. Yeah, let's let you attack so that way you get countered. Give him the heal. Nice and healthy. Ooh, training Lance Plus. Oh, there's a teleporter there? You can act after warping. I can't reach it, so I won't be able to know which way it goes. Flame Spirit, protect me. Got a door key. Beneath me, no. as you dodge, and now you're dead. That was tough. Where this way goes. Interesting apparatus. I wonder if we can operate it. So you have come. I'll make sure you never leave. Ooh, this is not so great. Have Might send Caspar over the help. Gain some experience. Oh, you can actually open this door.
Nice dodge, Caspar. Zero damage. I won't go down so easily. Yep, that didn't work. So let's go over here. Operate the lever. Oh, so this does not lead to the chest. Great. So it's one of these teleporters then. Let's heal her from way over here. Ferdinand, charge in! Only a fool challenges me. Only a fatile. Oh, that unlocked both doors. So I'm gonna have to experiment with these teleporters and see which, where each one leads. Oh, and there's another chest all the way up here! Hello! Right makes mine, right? Give you a good stabbing. You will be flashed down. My heart is full of victory. 
I'm surprised. Let's move everybody forward. Good for her to indulge that. <laughs> Counter! That is that. Just gonna easily take you out. That's how it goes. There's so much left to learn. So I know this teleporter and I think it was this one don't lead to chess. So I think it's these one and these two I'm left to check out. Yep, another critical hit hingaming. Are we done? Truly amazing. Take this guy out. This was beneath me. Found a rusty bow. Uh, who hasn't still moved yet? Oh, Casper, I'm like, who hasn't moved yet? I'll have you warp back because I'll use you to check out the other teleporters. Some special tiles have been deactivated. Oh, so that turns off the evade floors. <laughs> and the floors up here. Okay, that leads here, so these two have to be the chest tiles. Still not in range to attack somebody. Yeah. 
hit you with my sword. Should I have held back? Give you a nice stabbing. The mark of nobility. Send that to the convoy. Warp you in. Have uh, you going to deal with the chest that's way over there? Let's heal a bash. Much appreciated. Now, while everybody, so I'm gonna wait until I get those two chests and pretty much get everybody to wait up at the Death Knight's door. Helpful. We can all charge in and at him all at once. Do you not move? Okay, you do not move. I'm like, surely Caspar has to be in range. Ooh, you're... Okay, I thought that was the Death Knight that was going to attack Ferdinand. It's like, no. Thank God. Greatness awaits me. Dodge. Ooh, actually, now that I think about it, I think deactivating the tiles is good, because, yeah, because the Death Knight's standing on a tile. I think this would, like, up his resistance or something like that. I forget what that particular floor tile does. But yeah, actually deactivating those floor tiles was actually a good thing. Back to the fresh. Just shoot him through the door. I presume she's aiming her arrow above the wall. Let's smack you with an axe. You see that? Nice work. Uh, right, Dorothea. I'm like, who hasn't moved? Right. Uh... No, I'll stay where I am. I'm good now. Kill you up. 
Let's have everybody wait around the doors. Dory, we'll have you come back this way. The mock ring. What does that do? A ring that increases movement. I might off screen look at, through my equipment and start equipping some equipment on these characters. Ooh, the Leaven Sword. A sword that does magical damage and allows you to, to attack from range. Uh, yeah, they should definitely be back in time. Aren't a little... Aren't that worried. I owe you one. Especially her. This Petra has a lot of movement. Let's just unlock the door. I forgot if you kill everybody else. You are getting in the way of my game. Huh. You'll have more opportunities to play soon. Your work here is done. Understood. I will go. We will cross paths again. I am the Flame Emperor. It is I who will reforge the world. Flame Emperor? Rather worrisome that he sounds intent on showing up again. Are they both okay? We should get them out of here. The enemy is withdrawn. Let's carry them up. I forgot that if you kill everybody, the Death Knight uh, goes away. So I missed out on that dark seal. Whoops! Forgot about that detail. Ah, uh, note to self: don't. Note to self: next time you do Black Eagle, oh, to get a second dark seal, do not kill everybody. Cause I completely forgot that was a thing. pale and their pulses are slow. Still, I don't believe their lives are in danger. You found Flame? Where? You missed the most important part of the mission. We found her within that secret passage. The culprits were the Death Knight and... What was his name? Ah, the Flame Emperor. Sadly, they got away. All that matters is Flame's safety. Right, Professor? Right. We will take these two to the infirmary. Professor, please inform Seteth. Whatever the circumstance, I'm glad Flame is safe. Though I'm curious to find out who that other girl is. Huh? Professor? 
Is that a smile? <laughs> you look happy. I don't think I've ever seen you like this before. Anyhow, we should hurry to Sedef. He must be beside himself by now. Professor, please allow me to express my eternal gratitude once more. Flane is safe and sound, and I have you to thank for that. Mere words could never express how thankful I am. I... I am indebted to you. I couldn't have done it without the students. Yes, of course. I shall express my gratitude to the students as well. But why was Flane taken to begin with? Her kidnapper was the Masked Knight who vanished during the Rite of Rebirth, the one known as the Death Knight. Considering the circumstances, it seems plausible to assume that his true identity is Yuritsa. And we cannot forget about the mysterious Flame Emperor. His true motives are yet unclear. However, I have an idea. I believe the enemy may have been after Flane's blood. The blood that flows through her veins is special. It is extremely rare, and extremely dangerous. If enemies who know the secrets of Flane's blood have appeared, our only option is to leave the monastery and go into hiding. Brother, wait. Flane, what are you doing here? You should be resting. I do not like the path of your thoughts. I do not wish to live in some lonely, remote location where I never get to see anyone. Not ever again. If we stay here, you may be targeted again. Wouldn't it be better for the two of us to live in peace? Even if we ran off to some new, secret location, there is no guarantee that they would not find us. That is why I believe it would be safest to stay in the monastery, where we are surrounded by capable knights and professors. I see your point. I do. However... You know it is the only reasonable option. What if I were to join the professor's class? That is a great idea. You think so too? I am so very pleased to hear that. With a professor like you nearby, I shall be safe no matter what foe should appear. I see. I am afraid you have a good point. Professor, due to my position, I have closely scrutinized everything about you. After all that has happened, I must admit that you are indeed a trusted ally. So what say you? Can I entrust you with Flame's safety? It would be my pleasure. I am so glad that Flane is safe, yet I can't help but wonder what the story is about that other girl. She wore the uniform of the Academy, but who is she? Well done, Professor. I see that I was right to ask your class for assistance. I have been told that Manuela and Flane are recovering nicely, as is Monica. Is Monica a student here? Monica, the girl you rescued along with Flane, is also a student of the Officer's Academy. However... She is a student from last year's class. She went missing just before she would have graduated. It never occurred to us that something might have happened to her at the monastery. We assumed she had run away. I never dreamed that we would find her. Not like this. Monica has asked to rejoin the Black Eagle House once she has fully recovered. Our enemies are still out there, so we must remain cautious and continue our investigation. However, we must also help the students to move on from this incident. After all, the Battle of the Eagle and Lion will be held in Grander Field next month. Yes, the students will remember it for the rest of their lives. Please guide them so that they may show us their best at the coming battle. So, you'll be going to Grander Field next month. You've never been there before, have you? There is unease in the western side of the Empire, but everything east of the capital, Anbar, is stable. Well, there was a noble rebellion a short while ago, but it didn't amount to much. 
Will you come to the Battle of Eagle and Lion? Sorry, but I've got my own mission, and it's far from Grander Field. The Church has always been quick to make use of those who work for them. What I'm more concerned about is finding out who among us is pulling the strings. Ever since the Rite of Rebirth, strange groups have been seen around Garrig Mach and elsewhere too. There was also an incident where some knights investigating these suspicious strangers turned up dead. Not that it's likely, but if something like that ever happens to me, search this room, every corner, behind every shelf, I'm going to leave something for you. Don't, don't say things like that. Don't get me wrong, I have no intention of dying. I know it would be too much to ask you to cheer up, but can you at least drop the serious... <laughs> well, I'll be. Was that a smile just now? And with that, we'll end the episode here. So in the next episode, we'll, it'll start the next month. <laughs> And I'm also going to have to write down, make sure I write this down, that if I kill everybody in the map, the Nef, the, the Nef Knight goes away? No, the Death Knight goes away. Because I could have gotten that Dark Seal ill for, um, for Hubert. Uh, well, anyway, if you enjoyed this, do you like the videos? It helps tremendously. Subscribe if you haven't already, leave a comment down below on your thoughts this episode, and share the video so more people can discover my content and help the channel grow. And I'll see you all next time. Later!